so today I am at my hairdresser's salon, uh, Willow Hair in New Farm in Brisbane. You guys probably know that I've been growing my hair for quite a while. I've been doing everything right, I've been taking the vitamins, I've been eating well, I've been drinking water. So my hair grows out nice and strong, but like anyone, I only have so much patience. And I'm really eager to get that quick fix and to have long hair, even if it's for a day. So I was lucky enough to be sent some hair extensions by Lady Jane. They're a new product that they sent me to trial. Now I've never ever used hair extensions in my life and I don't pretend to be an expert at anything to do with hair. So I decided I would come to my hairdresser, Costa, and I would get him very kindly to show us how to put the hair extensions in um, and just tell us a bit about what they're like and what he thinks of them. So that's what I'll be doing today. I went out past that week popping the Lady J hair extension to shave his head. Um, as you know with the extensions, there's a few different ways you can use extensions. There's clip-ins, there's um, beaded extensions, which are permanent. But um, I think I picked the beauty about these Lady J clip-in extensions. It allows you to have instant hair um, straight away and voluptuous hair. So what I'm going to show you tonight is basically popping, popping the Lady Jane extension into the hair and where to place it and what it's all about. So I'm just going to section up. So if we start off with the crown, nice clean horseshoe section. So with the Lady Jane hair extension, it's actually uh, a synthetic fibre, so it does look like real hair. Um, you can use uh, heated tools on it up to 210 degrees. So basically you can curl it again, you can straighten it. So what we're going to do is we've done our horseshoe section through the top of the crown. I'm going to go through and tease up the back of the hair. This will enable the hair extension to clip into it because there's a few clips through the back which I'll show you in a moment. So basically put a bit of teasing in it just for allowing the clips to grab into. Don't I look lovely? <laughs> <laughs> so I'll show you the back of the extensions. We've got about, uh, basically we've got about six to eight clips in there. So what we do is we start off through the back in the middle. We just open up the clips. All the combs. Pop it through some of the tease section. Basically what we're, what we're using this right now is we, we feel like we're missing a bit of length so you'll see in a moment that we gain an instant length in about five minutes. I know her, Shana's hair is straight and we are working with curly but it just gives you an idea. So basically place them from behind the ear or on the ear around the crown and to the other side. It's quite firm, it's not going to go anywhere. It can be tied up into a ponytail once the other hair comes over the top. Because we're working with straighter hair, what I'm going to do is work with a bit of a curl into her natural hair to blend in. I think the product's fantastic. It just, it, like again, I keep saying, it just gives you instant hair. I think this what this lady needs. The best part of tonight and really getting to know this product is I feel quite safe in the knowledge that I can do this at home. I wanted to come to Costa first because as I said I have no experience with hair extensions but after this little how-to session I feel really confident that I'll be able to clip these in, I can tease my own hair and I can really place them nicely for instant volume and instant length when I need it. Now I'm not so good with the curling bit, <laughs> so I might need to call on Costa's help for that one. <laughs> look, it's all easy. I make, I make it look easy, but it is easy for you guys oh, to do at home. He makes it look amazingly easy. Every time I try to do it, I'm fine on the sides, but as soon as I get to the back is where I really start to struggle. I just wished I could rope my boyfriend into helping me do it. If he could just do the back section, I'd be fine. Or partners ahead of time. Oh yeah, that'd be the next best thing. 
So just recapping on the actual hair extension itself, I think it's quite nice. It just it really allows you to have the best of both worlds um, for nights, daytimes, you know, long, short, curly, straight. But you can take it away and put it back in your cupboard and reuse it in six months' time. Okay. Okay, so now basically I've just popped the piece in, I've recurled Shana's hair. Basically we've just got we've got a couple more inches gained. We've got some voluptuous sort of sexy hair going on. I think it looks great, like it's just it's instant. Like hope you like. I'm pretty impressed with the results. To be honest, we've sat here for about five minutes and we've achieved this much. Obviously, Costa's an expert, but like I said, I feel pretty safe that I can do it at home and try and replicate the look. And I think the result is amazing. I mean, I definitely feel sexier. <laughs> and I just, it feels more voluptuous and more glamorous, really. It'd be great for a, a nice night out on the town, I think. I think also, um, you sort of, you don't really get allowed to tie your hair up a lot. So it's nice that you'll be able to tie it up and sort of pinch oh, it to the side I and you get another that. look. Yeah, okay. love it. So you get a bit of a, a low, low do ponytail. Okay. Gorgeous, a bit of an embellishment here. That would look stunning with a nice dress. Love it. Beautiful. Yeah, well thank you Costa. Thank um, you. This has been Costa from Willow Hair at New Farm in Brisbane. My hairdresser extraordinaire. Love him to pieces. <laughs> Everyone should come and see him. <laughs>